what it costs to have a what Thai girlfriend. It costs to have a Thai girlfriend. Well, if you've been unfortunate enough to have a girl from a bar, you're still paying that 3,000 baht a day. She comes on holiday with you and the, the fines from the bar, they continue and your restaurant where she gets a cut of the menu or the food or the drink because she has a loyalty card. She take you where she thinks she should need to take you to get her cut. Anyway, guys, you've been more lucky enough to have one of those which just found a girl in a natural way. Your costs are zero. It's the only thing you're not to pay is what you would normally do if you met a girl. But anyway, guys, let's go on. So if you're going to go back to England and you need a, you know, you want to keep her as she is, that little princess working in the bar, and you don't want her in the bar, you know, you think, oh, I, you know, I don't want my girl there. You want a sponsorship, do you? Oh, my God, guys. So you're really going in deep now. You don't need that if you have a girlfriend. You know, run away from it. You know, I've had two marriages. I've never had a sponsorship yet. I give the money when, you know, the family when it's needed, but nothing otherwise. So your sponsorship. Oh, my gosh. So the guys have met that girl. Maybe they put a little card out and bumped into a few people in a few natural places. It's costing them nothing. The girl has a normal job and a family. These girls, it's their business. Carry on charging you. It's a business, guys. So they'll be taking you next, I suppose, down the line of the subscription. The subscription would be like 20 or 25,000 baht a month for the rest of your year or two years. Ever how long you both are going to hang it out for if you can it's expensive it's not like many years ago it's been quite reasonable now Twenty-five thousand baht a month and then you've got the airfares to go and see her you know your bar girl if you've got an ordinary girl you've met yes it's a, you will still be enough to get the flights there but maybe you know you'll be uh you know settled a little bit more because you don't have to worry about all those ongoing costs you know if you do have a bar girl guys get yourself an agreement for it all gets too much you know you can end up in a really serious place financially you know i'm not telling you this because there's nothing wrong with bar girls they're girls what have come from farming land and they need an income but there's the ones who take advantage of your situation Granny's, you know, Granny's got a, a, you know, needs an operation. I have no money or, you know, maybe I need to go to the dentist or the daughter because many of these girls have uh, children anyway. So, you know, your costs will just keep going up. Stay away from it if you can, guys. Find a nice, normal girl, you know. I talked to somebody this morning off on my uh, website, you know, on the website, uh, TikTok, and the guy said what he did. He put out business cards. He went around like normal shopping areas, talked to girls, giving a little card, you know, just a little, hey, this is me. What a great idea, guys. So, you know, but anyway, you're all, either one of you or both of you, I'll be going to see the family. That's the best way. Continue, guys. Don't forget that there are many bar girls I've met in my own country, which have made fabulous wives so don't take too much notice. it's why they're in that place to work you know it's a business once you get out that agreement you'll be fine if it ever gets to that far <laughs> if you don't go broke in between so and then you know once you get there then there's a the section where you know obviously you're gonna have to come to england the girl will come and that's a whole different thing guys i've done that already let's go through that tomorrow maybe but this is part two of the one from yesterday but anyway guys i really hope that was helpful to you if there's any question dm me i don't mind asking any questions you know this old dog i've been coming in almost 24 years i don't know it all and uh, you know obviously people have different opinions this is just Freddy, Thailand. We look forward to seeing you again tomorrow guys i hope you enjoyed that is anything you thought i missed let me know comments in the box be really interesting thanks guys